Hi, I'm Andy and welcome to Staples Tech TV Unboxing Edition. Today we're going to be looking at the Asus Zenbook laptop or more specifically Ultrabook. Now if you haven't heard the term Ultrabook, it's a new category of laptops. It's a term that's been coined and trademarked by Intel and all the manufacturers that are making Ultrabooks have to meet Intel specifications to call it an Ultrabook. Now the first criteria they have to meet has got to be ultra thin. And that means the thickness can be no more than two centimeters on either side. Secondly, they have to be ultra responsive. So they're going to have to have SSD like speeds in terms of the hard drive, which is why most Ultrabooks have SSD hard drives or solid state hard drives built inside. And lastly, they have to be at a mainstream price. So you're going to see these Ultrabooks come at the thousand dollar range, maybe up to 1200, depending on what kind of processor and specifications you have. But Generally, they will be in that $1,000 range. Now, I've heard a lot about this Zenbook. It's supposed to be a beautiful Ultrabook, so I can't wait to see it for myself. Let's see what's inside. All right, so let's open this up. First thing I gotta admit, beautiful packaging. The box looks awesome on the outside. Let's see what it looks like in the inside. And there you go, right here. Let's take it out. So the first thing you're going to notice is it's an all aluminum chassis, which gives it a beautiful finish on the front and also on the back. Very, very nice. As I mentioned before, this is an Ultrabook, which means it's super, super thin. Right here on the front, at the front of the laptop, it's only three millimeters thick. And right here on the back, nine millimeters thick. So, as I mentioned before, Ultrabooks have to be under 20 millimeters. So this is almost half of that size. We can see over here, the mini micro HDMI. We have a USB 3, and we also have the DC jack here. And this is where you would plug in the power. Turn over here, and here it is. Here's the mini VGA, USB 2.0, and your audio jack. So when you think of something like this thin, you're probably going to wonder if the battery life is going to be compromised. But it's not. You're still going to get about eight hours on a single charge of normal use. So let's uh, open this up. I'm really curious to see how it looks in the inside. And there you go. First thing I got to mention is you can see this is an 11 inch screen. Now that means that this is the UX21 model of the Zenbook. There's also a UX31 model, and that's the 13-inch side screen. So if you're looking for a bigger screen size, that's the one you'll want to get. But for most people, this 11-inch will do fine. Uh, in terms of audio, here's the speakers right here. Now, one thing I should note is the audio has been provided by Bang & Olufsen, and that's a high-end, reputable brand for audio. So you know that the speakers are going to be top-notch. Beautiful keyboard layout. And the trackpad here, you'll notice that there's a little divider here, and that's to basically tell you which is the left and the right click. The cool thing about this trackpad is it's also got pinch and zoom capabilities that you would see on smartphones and tablets. So if you want to make fonts uh, bigger, you just simply use your two fingers, just like that. Uh, in terms of specs, this one here is a Core i5, and I can see it right over here. And it's kind of funny because normally this is blue. These, these are blue, but because of this nice uh, finish, they've actually kept it gray so that it doesn't compromise the look. If you're looking for a uh, Core i7, you can get it into this model. And that's the highest processor out there from Intel right now. This has 128 gigabytes of SSD memory and 4 gigabytes of DDR3 RAM. So you're going to get the top of the notch. You're not compromising on the specs when you get something that's both thin and light. Speaking of light, this weighs only 2.3 pounds. It's very light in my hand and you notice it once you pick it up. Let's look at what accessories come inside the box here. Got this little package here. Just like that, and you can hook up an external monitor right to your Ultrabook. Something else in here, let's see. Ah, this is nice. So this, if you have an older uh, style and you want to use Ethernet cable, simply plug this into the USB 2.0 port, and now you have that option as well. In terms of the power 
adapter here. It's a really nice size. You know, the last thing you want is an Ultrabook with a big power adapter. And this one actually is, is really nice. It's portable and you can see the outlet here jumps in and out, which makes it great for traveling. And then that, like I said before, it would come right into here on the side. I think there's one more thing inside this box. Oh, look at that. Let me just pull this out. And it also comes with a free, beautiful case to stick it in. Let's see how this fits inside here. Now this makes it, when you talk about portability, this is going to help you keep it safe while you have it on the go. And it nicely snugs in and just like that. So if you're in the market for a new laptop, you definitely want to check out this new Ultrabook category and specifically this Asus Zenbook. The beautiful thing about this is it doesn't supplement your existing laptop, it's going to replace it because it's got that Core i5 processor or even a Core i7. It's ultra portable, ultra light and ultra thin. You really can't go wrong. Head to your local Staples store and check it out for yourself and you'll know exactly what I mean. I'm Andy for Staples Tech TV, see you next time.